Vastu Siddhi cannot be killed. Yes. But the external. Vastu Siddhi, but you know, if anyone has attained Vastu Siddhi and that transcendental body he has attained, then. asking because now internationally all the devotees are communicating through this internet, the computers. So there's debate going on if it's possible that a uh, Mahabhagavat or a very high uh, uh, Vaishnava guru can be poisoned or killed. Never. Never or just externally, the body can be... If he is playing a lila like that, he can so bite magic. But actually anyone cannot touch, air cannot touch, poison cannot touch, fire cannot touch, any material thing cannot touch. Hmm. Never. If he is leaving only because Krishna has called him, Go on. But then those who have attempted to it. Oh, they will be punished to extent. Like anyone wanted to kill Pandavas and their bodies were transcendental. But Purjodhan and others wanted to do and they were smashed. Like uh, what? Dushasana and other. <laughs> when, when, remember, in, uh, when we were in Vrindavan uh, four years ago, and Kadamba, Kadamba was shot. Uh, so then you went to him and you said, don't take revenge. Now you remember? You were with me? Sometimes. Oh. So, this point, is this also true uh, for the disciples of Swamiji, not to take revenge? If they are qualified, otherwise they cannot take it, never they can touch. And that is why if they are not real disciples and they have not taken any initiation, Internally, they cannot fall. Never. It's so here only. We try to develop. They cannot fall. First, what is the initiation? 